German stateswoman and chancellor Angela Merkel was born Angela Dorothy Kastner on July 17, 1954, in Hamburg, Germany. The daughter of a Lutheran pastor and teacher who moved his family east to pursue his theology studies, Merkel grew up in a rural area north of Berlin in the then German Democratic Republic. She studied physics at the University of Leipzig, earning a doctorate in 1978, and later worked as a chemist at the Central Institute for Physical Chemistry, Academy of Sciences, from 1978 to 1990. After the fall of the Berlin Wall in 1989, Merkel joined the Christian Democratic Union CDU, political party. Soon after, she was appointed to Helmut Kohl's cabinet as Minister for Women and Youth, and later she served as a Minister for the Environment and Nuclear Safety. Following Kohl's defeat in the 1998 general election, she was named Secretary General of the CDU. In 2000, Merkel was chosen party leader, but she lost the CDU candidacy for chancellor to Edmund Stoiber in 2002. In the 2005 election, Merkel narrowly defeated Chancellor Gerard Schroeder, winning by just three seats. And after the CDU agreed a coalition deal with the Social Democrats, SPD, she was declared Germany's first female chancellor. Merkel also became the first former citizen of the German Democratic Republic to lead the reunited Germany and the first woman to lead Germany since it became a modern nation state in 1871. She was elected to a second term in 2009. Merkel made headlines in October 2013 when she accused the U.S. National Security Agency of tapping her cell phone. At a summit of European leaders, she chided the United States for this privacy breach, saying that spying among friends is never acceptable. Shortly afterward, in December 2013, she was sworn in for a third term. Midway through her second term, Merkel's approval plummeted in Germany, resulting in heavy losses in state elections for her party. However, she scored well on her handling of the Euro crisis. Merkel's approval rating dropped again in October 2015, during the European migrant crisis. In the 2017 federal election, Merkel led her party to victory for the fourth time. The fourth Merkel cabinet was sworn in on March 14, 2018. The negotiations that led to a grand coalition agreement with the Social Democrats, SPD, were the longest in German post-war history, lasting almost six months.
In October 2018, Merkel announced that she had decided not to run for re-election in the 2021 federal election. On September 26, 2021, elections proved inconclusive. Although the SPD won the most votes, this necessitated long negotiations among the various parties to form a government. On October 23, 2021, the new coalition was announced, with Olaf Scholz nominated to succeed Merkel. Merkel continued to serve as a chancellor in a caretaker capacity until December 8, 2021, when Scholz was sworn in. Merkel's style of government has been characterized by pragmatism. Although critics have decried her approach as the absence of a clear stance and ideology, she demonstrated her willingness to adopt the positions of her political opponents if they proved to be sensible and popular. One notable example of that was Merkel's decision to phase out nuclear power in the wake of the Fukushima accident in 2011 after having passed a law to prolong the operating life of Germany's nuclear power plants only two years earlier. Merkel's handling of the Eurozone debt crisis, on the other hand, led to criticism of an approach many considered too strict. In spite of those challenges, the leader of Europe's most populous and economically powerful country continued to enjoy strong domestic approval numbers. In 2011, Merkel was awarded the U.S. Presidential Medal of Freedom.